Please leave him alone. Don't bug him dear and don't bug yourself either. Yes, I understand. You are attracted to him since that day you met him in church. Hum, you like his voice, his height and even his family background is just really cool. He is just the type of husband you wish to marry you feel so strongly in your heart that he might just be the answers to all those prayers. You have even exchanged numbers at the wedding of your mutual friend. As you got home, that day he called to find out if you arrived safely. I quite understand your feelings. To even arose your interest the more, two days later, he sent you a text message saying he just wanted to check on you. Oh so sweet of him. Coincidentally you were just thinking about him. You have started chats and calls with him. An emotional attachment is lingering in the last three months. You have been enjoying his companionship and friendship. Your hopes are getting raised up. But last month, he did not call nor send any text message. You are wondering. What happening? Can he just abandon you like that? Here is the answer, you may just be assuming that he is also interested in you. Yes. Ladies easily make such assumptions. Note, that a guy is nice to you, calls you and sometimes sends SMS does not mean proposal. Until he goes to see the pastor and proposes to you, don't assume anything. In some occasions, you may have spoken with your pastor about your leading. He may have talked to him. Some of your mutual friends may have hinted your interest to him as well, but he may just not be keen to marry you. Please don't throw yourself on him. Control your emotions. Let him be free to make his choice. Keep your dignity and self-respect. That man may in reality be having someone else in his mind.